Cami's comment tools allow you to create and save instructions using a text comment, voice comment, video comment, or even a screen capture. So if you were to assign this to your students, you can go in and click randomly on the page and type in directions for your students. So do your best. This will save right here on this little blue dot and the students, when they get their copy of it, they can just click the blue dot and this comment will pop up on their screens. You can also do voice comments. So if you click voice comments, same thing if you just click randomly on the screen, wherever you want it to be, or you can actually highlight a certain area of text. Once you highlight it, it automatically begins to record so you can tell your students whatever you want them to know right here with whatever directions they need to know. And then press stop. Everything that you just said will be here for the students to hear when they see this highlighted section of their document. You can also do a video comment. So same thing, either click on the page so it will bring up a dot or highlight something so you can highlight a particular word once i let go of my mouse is going to begin recording with my camera so you're able to come in now give your directions to your students with using a video so if you had something that you wanted to show them you can show that to show it to them right here or if you just wanted your students to see your face as they were doing their work you can do a video comment and leave it anywhere on the page then once you're done click done and your video comment will be here They can click play. They can listen to it over and over and over again. So you can give those directions to your students, put this in a small group, and they won't have to bother you at all because you have given them the directions right there in Cami. And the last one, which is my favorite, is screen capture. So not only are you going to be able to record the screen that you're on right here in Cami, you can also go to different websites. So if I click here, and begin my screen recording. I'm on my screen recording here. I can share just the tab, so any tab that I have open, or I can share my window or an entire screen. So I'm going to share my window right now. If I choose window, choose the window that I want, click share, and automatically it is recording this screen. So I can tell them, read through this passage. Make sure that you use your text box to put in your answer choices right here. Don't forget to go on to the second page. If you need extra assistance, come here, open up a new tab, and go into our Google Classroom. And I can go on and on and on. Everything that I need them to be able to do with step-by-step -step directions showing them how to do it. And I come back over and click done and everything that I did will be right here for my students to see so if they needed to make it bigger they can click on this little box and it's going to make it full size and they can go through and look at the directions over and over and over again they can click rewind see where to go and then when they're done they can click right here come back to their screens and begin working. So comments are amazing for small group work. It's amazing for homework. It's amazing for um, individual student work. Anytime that you need your students to focus and you don't want them coming to you to ask you all the questions, preload your documents with all of your comments, all of your directions, your voice, video, screen captures, and assign it to the students and they will have everything that they need right in front of them without having to come to you to ask questions.